Hey everyone, Eric here from Lapix. Got another video for you guys today. Got this A1707 15 inch MacBook Pro. We're actually making a video, or probably may have actually already released the video by now um, for this one doing the repair for it because uh, this has been, uh, the, the battery actually has been replaced on this model by a, a client. And um, the replacement battery, and they, uh, and it wasn't actually charging, and they actually knocked part of the battery connection here, but we did a replacement for it, but that's another video. Obviously check that out if you're really interested in that. But there was also a problem with the trackpad not working. Now when you see here, obviously this battery has been removed. I want to give you guys a little bit of a tip uh, before you do any type of battery replacement. So there is glue to the battery, especially if you buy another one, there is going to be glue to that. You want to make sure that if when you do remove it, that you remove all the old ad adhesive tape there. Otherwise, the battery is just going to flap around in there. There's a, lot, there's a few cells that go in each one of these little blocks here. You want to make sure you remove this old adhesive. Otherwise, it's going to have trouble actually um, sticking right, and gluing, and it's going to flap around there. That's not going to be a good one. Another thing you also notice is that the trackpad is missing here. And the trackpad is missing because there was a problem with the trackpad as well. Now, if you're removing it or if you use any type of um, removal methods, usually there's like alcohol involved maybe. Please be safe with alcohol. And we see that there is a problem. Obviously, the, the battery has a, the battery would sit here and the battery looks like uh, the trackpad would be right under the battery, right? So that is definitely the case. Now, we do have a problem with this trackpad and I need to go into the microscope to actually take a look at that because it's very, very easy to do that. Because the battery would actually lay um, underneath and it's very easy to damage it. So I have the trackpad here. Let's go into the microscope real quick. I'll just take a look at it. So we see, we go under here and we're taking a look. Excuse all the food and dirt. That's not the main problem here. The main problem is this area, right? And we see this area it looks like it has been gone. Where's the, where's the resistor? It looks like it's gone. It's missing. Or it's broken. Did it fall out here somewhere? Here's the piece of it. There's a piece of evidence. You can see this board looks like it's been scratched. This has been a little bit damaged over here as well. And that looks like a problem. Now, if we go back to our um, laptop, now we take a look at that area. This is the damaged area over here. And if we look over here, it's <laughs> they make this pretty great. By doing this, there are holes here that actually do expose the trackpad, and it's very easy to knock it, especially if there's glue. Have a little bit of trouble, you go underneath it, and you're going to knock the trackpad. So this one does not only need to have the battery replaced. Now there's a problem with the connection itself. We're going to do another video. But for this one, it also needs a trackpad to be replaced. And we have to do that because it's very easy to damage that while you're doing while you're moving the battery. Um, if you're, if you're not sure, the, maybe another best way to be doing this, if you want to be really careful, just remove the trackpad first. We have lots of videos showing that if you want to go ahead and check that out. But just a little warning, FYI, for people out there, because obviously if it happens to one person, it's probably happened to a lot more people. So just a warning for you guys. If, you're, if you have a little bit of doubt, definitely make sure you take it in to a shop like us, and we can help you out there. We don't mind doing that because you don't want to turn uh, a battery re replacement into a board level repair and then you also have like a trackpad and other things going on so hope you guys have watched this video and found this very informative just a little warning message for you guys out there if you did please leave a like really does help us a lot subscribe for more content and we'll see you guys next video thanks a lot for watching guys take care bye